Okay. If uh, Usher wanted to bring Casey up on stage and, and do like a strip tease on her and grind on her, would you accept that? So, so Casey, I'm going to ask you a question. I know you're going to tell the truth. You know I know your okay. husband real well. Yeah. If, if we went to a club, all of us, yeah. and yeah. a dancer danced on him, right? Yeah. Would you have as much of a problem as a man walking up to you and putting his thing near your face and dancing and gyrating? Would I have a problem? Like my what? response to both? Yeah, yeah. Which one do you think? Wait, would be wait no, that doesn't make that doesn't make sense, Marcus. Which, because if a stripper is dancing oh, on my, my husband, he's obviously paid for a lot of dance or receiving it. You said a dude just walked past me and right, a, a male <laughs> stripper, a, a male stripper walking up to you and grinding <laughs> on you and doing all that. Which one is worse? <laughs> Which one is worse? Yeah, we both in the strip club. Well, I was about to yeah. say, so, not so in the strip club though, like okay, 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 yeah, you in the strip club with your man, and a, and a male stripper comes and starts. <laughs> it's a I wouldn't, co I wouldn't, co I wouldn't be at a male strip club with three. Well, yeah, I was about <laughs> exactly. To say exactly. Hey, that is my point. hey, hey, you need to say no. Oh, you're, oh, you're no getting that because that's, that's a little sus because, 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 because my husband ain't hanging out in no male. Strip okay, club, okay. but, but y'all could go to a female strip club, right? Yeah, but yeah. I probably all agree with it. It's on me too. Jeez. It's a double she standard. Double standard, exactly, exactly. No, but it's exactly. not. But, but I but you have Sweeney, to dance, like, dance on I'm me not, too. But you can't, Rick, Sweeney's trying to explain the standard depending on the relationship. Like it wouldn't be. Oh yeah, my husband could do it, and I'm or he can't do it, and I'm gonna divorce him. Versus like the opposite. I I see what Sweeney's saying. Like I don't. It it I it depends on the couple, but it should if the whole Kiki Palmer situation and the Chance the Rapper situation. Like if Kiki's doing that in her relationship, especially as a performer, as an entertainer, her. Her, what y'all saying? Oh, the dude should have divorced. It'll be okay if he divorced her for that. I and I agree with Sweeney. He would not divorce her for that. Like being in her position, in her role, what she does, and same as Alicia Keys. Like Alicia, that's what Alicia Keys been doing for twenty years. Like why would our why would Swiss Beats get mad at her for it? He was cheering her on. Like he's okay with that. So some people are okay with their husbands and wives like being flirtatious or in the midst of a performance like doing certain things like that's not it's not a it's not a double standard for a lot of couples is what i'm saying that's all i was pointing out is that it's not necessarily do women technically have different standards than us are women less likely to do it than men are fair i grant that argument what I'm saying is, is that if she was to say the reason why I divorced him was because he was out there gyrating with a woman, we can't look at her and say, hey, that's fucked up, man. You know that's what men do. And we just sat there and looked at the Daryl dude. I can't remember the nigga name. It's like, hey, man, your girl out there, she got to dance with Usher? Hell no. Nah, let that hoe go. Like, we can't say tell her different and then tell him different. My standards will be the same. Like, yes, hey, we can. If that's what yes, you want to can. Do, if that's how you no, want to go, you can't. You can't do that. Yes, you can. It's because it's you, not. Y'all just it's, it's accepted exactly the fact that there's a double it, standard. Brother. But I do understand why you're saying it because it's always been, and I think we're just looking at society, just period, how we were raised up. It's not acceptable for young women to be promiscuous. It's not acceptable for young women to be flirtatious or in a way um, inappropriate with men, especially if you are with a, a partner, you have a husband. It wouldn't be considered the fact for you to go out and be twerking on men or at any parties and doing any of that. Now, a Usher concert, first of all, nigga, if Usher come up to you and start singing, you definitely standing there and getting sang to by Usher. It's Usher. Come on now. He is a singer. That is a part of his job. It's a part of his job to come up and to perform, to penalize somebody for getting a performance, say a song sang to them by a singer. Wait, 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 time out. Wait, voice. Did you just say me? If did you just say me? Let's not get up and let Usher serenade you, bro. Yeah, he did it. Pause. First off, pause. And that's, no, that's no a big diddy. no. No diddy. No diddy. Yeah, no diddy. Yeah, no. 
I'm I'm wide open, open. let this nigga serenade you, bro. Now, hey, not listen, only, not only will me. we have a problem with it, you will have a problem with it too. If you exactly. sat there and watched Usher serenade exactly. your man, you will go home with a whole lot of issues, questions, comments, and concerns. I it's not the same. The same. Everybody's relationship. Everybody's relationship. Everybody's relationship. If, if, B, if B, okay, if Kelly Rowland, if Reese, me and Reese went to a concert and Kelly Rowland came over and she wanted to serenade Reese, baby, I'm going to stand there and I'm going to say, you better enjoy this. This is Kelly Rowland. That's just me. I would not have a problem with it. I would enjoy watching it. I'd be like, damn, a lot of dudes want to be inspired. Right would, you, now. Would, you like, let, would you let would you let him go on the stage with uh Janet Jackson? Yeah, I would. Did you see the performance before we before Yeah, we, I have. I saw, have saw when she was rubbing. <laughs> yes. I love it when she got on them on the plank and it went. It's, inter, it's, entertainment. it's entertainment. It's She's entertainment. She's an entertainer. You think I do I think that Janet Jackson want my man? No, she don't want my man. I'm the only one who want my man. She don't want him. You're terrible. I think like I think it's a different like <laughs> like me me and my husband been together for 16 years. We've been married for 11. Uh 17 years been married for 11. So it's like I don't know. I my husband come home every night. His phone's her- right there. He I mean I, I the simple things that like all this little stuff. This little stuff don't. It, it doesn't matter. Would, would you let August Alcina sing the Reese on on stage? No. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Hold, hold on. That's different. I got a question though. Would your husband Come let? Come on now. Would your husband Marcus, let Usher give you a lap dance? On stage? Likes men. Stop. Would your husband let Usher give you a lap dance on stage? Usher didn't give Kiki Palmer I'll a lap dance. No, take, take Kiki Palmer. Like if I wanted to mention Usher, I think like, he he probably would. would. Cap, I got to stick up for my brother. Hell no. Call Reese right now. Call Reese He'll be right like, now. I'll call him. Cap. I'm, <laughs> I'm calling. Hey, call him up right now. Hey, hey call Marcus, Reese right now. Right now. Pull up the receipt. All right, I'm going to say no. I never met him, but I've <laughs> like, I think Ruth wanted to say something. What did you say, Trev? Roof. I, said, I, think, I think it's different because if it's a celebrity, then it's kind of like they're, you already kind of accept them. But if it's a random girl that's like dancing on her, like things can happen from there. So, yes, I did say y'all are hypocritical and judgmental. Thank you so much, Trev, for proving my point today because it wasn't even 20 seconds before you contradicted yourself. And you're glad to have that double standard. But um, you guys give me off what people. Huh? Marcus, do you got him on the phone? Hold on, hold on. Call my husband because he's on the road right now. Finish. Casey, you want me to ask him this question or you want me to ask him quietly? You got, got him. him? All right. So, so Reese, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. You you live right now. Can y'all hear him? Reese, yeah, say something. I, I hear a little bit so. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. If uh Usher wanted to bring Casey up on stage and and do like a strip tease on her and grind on her, would you accept that? No. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you said. Thank you. I <laughs> thank you. <laughs> He said, no, hell no. Thank you. Girl. Yes, they Thank you. Make they, girl. they too scared. Oh, my God. Like, just go home. Don't go to the concert. Hey, no. I can see the trap in real market right now. I can see the argument, bro. Y'all won. I can see it. I love you, bro. Marcus <laughs> added strip. He added strip. Don't do that. He definitely <laughs> added some hot sauce. He added Come on, country. Like, we're not going to play. We did not. That was not a part of the question. Okay. Ask the same question. We said the Alicia Keys Kiki situation. If Janet Jackson would have brought Reese up on stage and did a, a little strip tea dance or whatever, would you be tripping about that? That's my point. That was my whole point. I can see, bro. I can see the argument. All right. Hey, look. I can see. Hey, that shit. 